Michael's House is a, it's a really wonderful organisation. It does an incredible job in the community. Uh, it's, it's got 170 facilities uh, around the greater Dublin area and it provides the, its clients with, with a fantastic uh, quality of life and, and care. Well, we're delighted to welcome St Michael's House here today after 21 years of supporting uh, St Michael's House. Um, they're here at the Island Golf Club today with another uh, packed time sheet. It's not the longest course in the world, but as you can see, looking out the window here, we were surrounded by dunes, very high dunes around the course. Uh, it's a challenging layout. We just hosted British Open qualifying two weeks ago. Um, so we set the course up quite difficult, but not tricky, as they say in the golf business. The island here in uh, Donabate has raised for, uh, monies in the past to support local um, services that St Michael's House have. For example, it has one residential house and it has two houses that support respite, both for adults and for children. Uh, also today we're going to support um, training and development for a centre in Mask Road, which is in Artane in Dublin. The St Michael's House Island Golf Classic event is helping to support St Michael's House and provide services for trainees within our service to, to learn more independent living skills through um, the provision of VTAC courses. In we learning independent living skills. It's like cookery and we could do at home. You could make things like baked potatoes and beans, beans on toast or um, scrambled eggs and toast. Today I made um, scrambled eggs and toast. I like to do uh, money management. Learn how to uh, manage your money. I think it'd be nice to have maybe more equipment. Learn more how to use the iPads. Learn how to use the laptop. It's a good centre, yeah, it's a nice centre. Do a lot of good work, do a lot of work. I did a art VTAC course and I got my results and I passed. Been an end user of Michael's house for 14 years through my son Mark um, and you know to be very straight about it, a lot of families in Ireland wouldn't be functional without the services provided by Michael's House. The care he gets in Michael's House is second to none. The love and the kindness he receives up there is outstanding and it helps us as a family to be functional. I can't compliment the committee and the people in Michael's House enough for the service they provide. St Michael's House really, really requires as much money as possible in order to keep up the quality and the quantity of service uh, which it already gives to its clients. St Michael's House are nearly 60 years old. We have 170 centres north and south of the city and it's a very expensive service. Um, the health service in Ireland is very expensive. So having the support of the Island Golf Club is extremely important. In the years gone by, we've supported our three units in Donabate, which is local to the Island Golf Club, um, which is very important. We have an adult and children's services locally within Donabate. And then also this year we have the 21st anniversary, the Island Golf Club and their members are supporting the FETAC learning courses for adults with intellectual disability. I would just like also to uh, say a big thank you to all the sponsors and uh, corporates that put teams in year after year. It has just been absolutely fantastic uh, to see that we can go back over the list and nearly every year we have the same people who come up trumps every time to put the money in to this uh, uh, day mm -hmm. and we appreciate it uh, very, very much. So. Uh, Thank you all for the wonderful uh, support that you've given us over the years and hopefully we can depend on you for the next few years as well.